Hi folks. You know in these here United States of America, they're making the news predominantly it has to do with the issue of President Barack Obama exercising executive privilege to protect his Attorney General Eric Calder from releasing documents to the Congress investigating the Fast and Furious uh, project that was undertaken by the Justice Department. So all the news, all the talk is about the constitutional crisis, executive privilege being abused, President Obama himself saying uh, some time ago that it was wrong to use executive privilege and yet he used it. They go on and on and on. But you know what we're forgetting in this story, folks? People died. Hundreds of people died because the government of these here United States of America under President Obama permitted weapons, automatic weapons, to be shipped across the border into Mexico. Even though some of those dealers called the ATF and had a concern about it, they were told to let those guns go across the border. An American Border Patrol agent was murdered with one of those weapons. Brian Terry. That's right. Mr. Terry is being forgotten in this whole situation. He was a Border Patrol agent murdered by one of those weapons. He also served in the United States Marine Corps. His parents want answers. His parents deserve those answers. You know, folks, one of the most horrific ordeals a human can go through that I can imagine is the loss of one child. I, I can't comprehend how a parent can endure such a gravity, such a loss as these parents had to endure with the loss of their son, Brian Terry. And then to see the circus being played out in Washington with this administration. As you hear news, as you read stories, let us not forget that Border Patrol agent, Brian Terry, who was murdered because of this program. All right, folks. We'll see you. God bless you. God bless America. God bless the nation you happen to be in. God bless Brian Terry's family and his soul. We'll see you, folks.